in my prayer, <clears throat> I was a little frustrated and God just reminded me that I was exactly in the place that I prayed about wanting to be. I had reached the place that I last year prayed and cried about often. This was here. But because it does not at all look like how I wanted it to look, I was upset. And I began to reject it and not just reject it. I called it something else. And in me calling it something else, I'm recognizing that I was cursing the blessing that God was giving me, that God had already given me. Can you imagine? Can you imagine praying about something, going and fasting on something, asking somebody else to pray and intercede with you? And here it is. You're already in it, but you don't recognize it. You're not taking ownership of it. You're believing that that's not what it is. And God just completely shifted me. God completely shifted me into me having no choice but to be grateful. And I know, we often know, or we um, sometimes you don't know, but God is looking at your response. He's looking at how you respond to something. And it's almost like, not it's almost like, in me praying for something and him giving it to me, it makes me think how many things have I missed or how many things have I not accepted or how many things have I not walked into because it didn't come the way I wanted it to come because it didn't come packaged how Amber thought it was going to be packaged. How selfish am I to think that I have the right to control how my blessing comes. I already said this before that I can't control the miracle. I can't control the, the, the blessing either. The destiny. I can't control what it looks like. I just understand that I asked for something and God gave it to me. But it didn't come the way that I wanted. <sighs> God is so like God. I don't even have any other word for it. Like, he's just so God. Like, who does that? God. God does. <sighs> if you've been praying for a thing, you've been asking, you've been interceding for a thing, accept that it may not come the way that you want it to come. Accept that it may not look like the box that you want it to be in. It might just come from the ground. <laughs> Because that's who God is. Like, that's just who he is. And I I really had to ask for forgiveness for rejecting what he'd already given me. It just trips me out. It trips me out. Super trips me out. God is strategic in all things. In everything, he's so strategic. In everything, he's so strategic. And that's simply, that's it. That's it. He knows how to give you what you need because he knows what you can handle. And some things we can't handle. Some things we're not ready for the fullness of it yet. But magnify him for even the portion. Magnify him for even the crumb that you receive, my God. Magnify him for this little because surely, mm, 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 surely, if we are faithful with just this, if we are faithful with just this, imagine, imagine, imagine what comes next. Our response in, in, in what he gives us, our response and being thankful for the crumb and being thankful for the crumb, my God. I'm just, I'm just really shifted. I'm shifted, I'm shifted and I'm just grateful. I'm grateful. Hopefully this, hopefully this video bless you. God, I thank you that you have answered my prayers. I thank you, Lord God, that you are answering the prayers of the people watching this video. I thank you that you are doing miraculous things in their lives, God, that you are performing miracles, signs, and wonders, not for them, God, but for their lineage, God. I legislate, Father, that everyone under the sound of my voice sees you differently. 
everyone under the sound of my voice is an out of out of the box thinker god because that's who you are i legislate lord god that there will be no rainy days god there will be no rainy days in their lives father in the name of jesus because they are looking at the day as pure sunshine that hasn't come yet in jesus name god we accept you as lord god and just tell you to continue reigning in our lives. We give you full access to be God and to move how you want to move, God. Continually move us out of the way. Move us out of the way. Move us out of the way, God. And make room for you. Help us to continue to make room for you. To continue to make room for you, Lord God. Help us to surrender often, daily, daily to you. To die to our flesh daily to you. Oh God, we just honor you. We just honor you for who you are. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. I pray that you were blessed. I said this video was short. I'm looking at like almost seven minutes, over seven minutes. Maybe. Yeah, it'll be seven minutes. Um, I love y'all. Thank you for watching. Those who have already subscribed, I really appreciate it. I love y'all. God bless you. May you have an amazing, beautiful day. God is just so good. Like, I feel like I could talk for about another 30 minutes, but I'm not going to do it because I don't necessarily like to watch long videos. So, I love y'all.